Right, my name is Stefan Dahlqvist, uh, one of the founders and uh, designers of Moods of Norway. We're here on uh, 113 South Robertson Boulevard together with amazing Paul Stolper from England and uh, Paul Stolper Galleries and Moods of Norway is this week doing a uh, art fashion collaboration at the LA Art Show. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> and uh, bringing in uh, incredible work from Damien Hurst, Jamie Reed and uh, many other great artists. And here at the Moods of Norway store today, we're just showing some of those artists and also collaborating a little bit and uh, crossing uh, fashion and art together. So, um, you love art. You're very creative, obviously. I can tell from the super fun suit and the cute Moods of Norway design. Yeah, super hot. It's uh, very good if it's sunny. Oops. If you're going down, uh, yeah. So, are you based in Norway? Yes, so we have our uh, headquarters in Norway, and then we also have uh, this little fun uh, LA hub. And you're in London. Yeah, I have a gallery in London, and I have a gallery in Oslo as well. So. And that's how your connection yeah. is. We have, done. Yeah, we have a mutual friend in uh, Norway who introduced us, and uh, just through you know we kind of got really friendly and we set up a festival in Norway that's still going and um, we're doing this collaboration here because I'm doing the LA art show that opens tonight at the LA Convention Center until Sunday and so you know the Moods boys invited me to do something in the window and so we collaborated on this um, project to you know show art in fashion stores at the, the Moods uh, US headquarters here and also to highlight my local library being closed down in the UK you know, a lot of libraries are being closed. And so Jamie Reed, who's a great agitator and anarchist who did all the artwork for the Sex Pistols, decided to uh, make a print for me to help raise money to save our local library. So we feel that education, which is, you know, is a birthright. And anywhere around the world, everyone ought to be able to receive a decent free education. And libraries, you know, contribute a huge part to that. So we're raising funds to keep our library open and so we can go run it ourselves. Oh, wow. That mm -hmm. is... You mean a city library? Yeah, in London. In London. They're closing loads of the libraries down. They are? Yeah, I'm trying to build super libraries, but of course, you know, it, it kind of strips naked a community that congregates at a library and, you know, uses the books and everything. So Local libraries know, the, bring connections. Pardon? Local libraries do connect the neighborhood. Yeah, 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 completely, you know. And our, our local library was opened in 1900 by Mark Twain, no less. In London? In London town, yes, ma'am. Oh my gosh, I did not realize yep. that. Well, so, you know, so the moods kind of get that and, you know, appreciate that. And so we're just highlighting that here and, you know, as I said, moods U.S. headquarters on sunny, sunny South Robertson. Exactly. So that's what we're doing. So now let's go inside, eat some more waffles, some cold champagne, and uh, call it a night. And then we see you later tonight at the L.A. Art Show. Yes. Thank you.
Bye, Paul. I look forward to seeing you this evening at the LA Art Show, where you're raising money for your local library that was started by in London. Thank you so much for speaking with me. I'm looking forward to seeing you this evening. Bye. Bye. Oh, there's no false fast pullout.